back live on NXT. Next, accompanied by Joe Coffey, representing Dallas, Mark Coffey, and Wolfgang. Coffey and Wolfgang, of course, a pair of former tag team champions. Would love to get almost see Wolfgang. It's still crazy to think that Mark Coffey is the calm one of the trio. And their opponents, the team of Pete Walker and Tank Ledger. Did you say, did you say calm? <laughs> yeah, that's the, that's, that's when you take a look at it, it's kind of uh, odd to say when it rolls off the tongue. <laughs> but then we're looking at the third team. Hey, Tank, do they have what it takes, Booker, to win tonight? You know, I'm going to say, uh, Tank and Tank, most improved tag team here in 2024, but that means nothing, man. That means nothing when it comes down to experience, knowledge, understanding. Are, that goes to the Gallus. What? You are the king of the backhanded compliment. Man, they're good in 2024, but they're not good enough tonight. Uh, I mean, what do you... I, took, I gave them props, didn't I? You I did. gave them props. You need to get on their social yeah, media show. Months ago, I wouldn't have said anything of the sort about oh. Hank Walker. You certainly would not look at Gallus going right at Hank and Tank. No love lost there, but here come the rest. That's the inexperience. You turn your back on the Gallus board, you might get jacked. Wentz had a big weekend with some help from Trey Miguel. Of course, Zachary Wentz had three matches, five days covering three states. Oh, is he 100% physically and emotionally both superstars with that double stop? What a matchup, though, Zachary Wentz had with Wesley. No, no. Uh, I must say he did go toe to toe with truly one of the best here in NXT and not just go toe to toe with him he got a victory and Trey Miguel almost got tossed into the post as big Hank running over Miguel for Trey Miguel this is his first match in nearly six weeks you know one thing about the Rascals they do throw a monkey wrench in this tag team division they're different. They're fast, agile, mobile, versatile. Oh, there we the go. Game, the oh, no. Wow. This submission will become the number one They're contenders for the NXT Tag Team Titles. Nice roll through by Miguel. Trying to take down. And this is the danger, though, the triple threat match, right, Book? Yes, you got to keep your eyes in the back of your head. One thing about the Gallus boys, they got that extra eyes. Hank into the, the cover. Show. Wolfgang breaking things up. Hank and Tank operate with the mindset. Hit first, hit last. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah that, that's the way you want to do it. Oh, man. You don't my. waste any time. If you can sucker somebody and get a three count, that's what you're going to do. Still to come, massive main event. Trick Williams taking on Pete Dunne. Has Trick figured it out? We're going to find out later tonight. Oh. And we're also going to hear from the NXT Women's Champion, Roxanne Perez, is live after that massive victory at No Mercy. But right now, when we talk about titles, the winner of this match become the number one contenders to the NXT Tag Team title, which, of course, we need to congratulate Axim and Frazier, who reclaimed the gold in Denver. Yes, big, big congratulations to Axim and Frazier. We talked about the, the, the state of the tag into the cover. Talked about the state of the uh, tag team division at No Mercy. Yeah, we did. And I feel like it, it's still wide open, man. It, it's still wide open for somebody to step in there and get that shot at become champions. Well, to that point, it was all three of these teams that made their cases over the weekend. Our general manager, Ava, decided, well, prove it in the ring, and that is what is oh, happening beautiful. right here to kick us off on and, NXT. And I truly believe the wild card here in this matchup is the rascal. These guys are here back in NXT and looking for the gold. I love it. And they're inching closer, possibly two gold is Miguel into another cover. And again, can you imagine if Hank and Tank was to do it? Could you imagine? Well, I mean, Booker, they had a major victory just a few weeks ago over the Good Brothers. I mean, what sort of momentum can this team build from a victory like that? Well, exactly Carried over into tonight. Exactly, exactly what I'm talking about, getting a win like that and stepping up in a, a three-way triple threat like this right here and walking out with a victory confidence to go straight through the roof, man, if they could just get some new gear. But I tell you, you always come back to the gear, don't you? Oh! Wentz, he's legal. Big kick. Goes up. Goes over. Coffee rolling through. Take out the leg. Man goes down and into the submission. Bad drive kick. Coffee inside. Look at this tandem. That's it. Wentz and oh my, just breaking it up. Hank Walker in the right place at the right time. Give this to big man credit. I've been trying to have you give them credit for a couple of months now. You're just starting to come around now. Is Wentz chopping away at Mark Coffee got caught though and again 
Triple threat rules. Look who's in control. Look who's standing. Look who's overpowering the competition. Oh, double up. It's Hayes. Double up. It's Tay. Oh, yes. Gallus wants some. Hank and Tank taking care of them, too. Hank and Tank rolling. There's a spine tingler right there, man. Say Trust that again. Me. Which one of these three teams is going to walk out tonight? Number one contenders to the NXT Tag Team Titles. Well, as you saw throughout the break, the Gallus boys have been on top. And, Brooke, this is a duo that held the NXT UK Tag Titles for nearly 500 days. The NXT Tag Titles at one point for over 170 days. They know what it takes to get the job done in high-profile matches like this into the cover. And somehow... Hank able to kick it out. Yeah, let's talk about the uh, Gallus boys coming off a hiatus within 30 days, capturing those tag team championships, looking to go on another big run. And right now, they are in total, total control with the direction of that man, Joe Coffey. Good to the last drop. You know it, man. He's been on the outside, shouting out, commanding the troops. But now all three men coach, from three coach. separate teams starting to swing away. Who's going to get the better? Whoa. It's like the Rascals and Gallus trying to work together. But Hank overcoming the odds. And take a look right up here from the desk. Tank is going nuts. Tank wants in this matchup. Tank can change the complexion. Here we go. Oh, baby. One thing about this guy right here. He's got that attitude once he gets going. Oh, Nick. oh yes. He's got a I like it. Of a Ferrari. Oh, he's dangerous. He hits like a tank. And like we said earlier, their motto hit first. Oh, look at Hit last. Wow. That could be it. Do we got number one contenders in this moment? And Zachary uh, uh, went uh, saving uh, things for the Rascals. As Trey Miguel made the tag, Miguel now legal step up in Seguri. Just rock tank. In comes Mark Coffey. Look at this offense. Beautiful, beautiful. The Gale's on fire right now, but got, oh, what the, step up oh. in Seguri. I don't know, must have went with that shot, took a lot of the pressure off of it. This kid right here is, is on the move, I like it, Vic. Oh, I'm, nice scorpion kick special, that? deck breaker combo, but take out right down the DDT. The Gale over the cover, the count, and everybody coming in to save this matchup for their respective I'm teams. I'm impressed with these rascals, Vic. Well, we had questioned before we came on air, Booker, you and I were talking, how would the Rascals, how would they handle the emotion carryover from the weekend? They certainly have been answering our questions. Hey, uh, Joe Coffey. Yeah, that? there is your man. Good the last drop. There is no disqualification. Hey, Javon Evans. Get him some low. He's concerned. Booker. Uh, what the hell's going on, Get out of here. It's the Good Brothers. Taking out Hank and Tank. But Tank's on his feet. Turns around. Into Mark Coffey, but look who's standing. Look who's climbing. Look who's flying. Look out. Is that it? Wentz. Double up. Into the cover. Up. What the? Celebration continues for them rascals. Here are your winners. The rascals. The emotional high for the rascals. Continues. But this one thing was starting to break down. First was Joe Coffey. Again, no disqualification. Javon Evans has had his issues with Gallus, with Coffey. Who else has had issues with some others is the Good Brothers, who came out here to take out Hank and Tank, which opened the door for this TNA duo to secure the victory and become the number one contenders wow. to the NXT Tag Team titles, which means now, Booker, think about this. Next week, part of WWE Week on USA, Axiom and Frazier defend the titles against the Rascals.